Sometimes we can feel very passionate about a certain project, whether it is a small side project or something very ambitious, like a whole video game or animated web series. But sometimes that passion and motivation go away, which is what happened with most of these videos at least. But yet, I still have the motivation and passion to finish this stupid fucking video. This video, not including the JTO without taking damage video, is the most highly requested video on my channel. Today, I'll be taking a look at my cancelled videos and projects, and show you what remains, or remnants of these videos, and talk about what could have been had I finished these videos. In the bonus video, which you will find in the outro, you can watch the unfinished videos in their full glory, so if you're interested in any of these projects particularly, you can view what I made on them, I guess. Anyways, let's begin. Oh hey, this was featured on the iceberg. This video did technically come out, but not in the way you expect. This video was meant to come out in the summer of 2017, but it never did, and now there's a gap in between vlog number 1 and vlog number 3. So what remains of this vlog? I got some footage and it turned out to be about a minute long. There were also some images that I added in this vlog for some reason, but why was this never uploaded to my main channel? The reason this vlog was cancelled was due to the lack of footage that I got. I mean, it's two minutes long. This would also be a rather lame vlog since I didn't do anything too special on the vacation that I recorded, and also I didn't go anywhere special. This video will never come out due to obvious reasons. This was meant to be my first ever review, and it was quite an ambitious project. This was going to be the best video on my channel, and I felt a lot of motiv and I had a lot of motivation while making this video. It was meant to release at the end of 2018. I actually edited all the events up to Battle Arena or so, but I only saved the sections from the Labyrinth event to Egg 2018. The script was nearly complete, although there were uncompleted sections. I managed to finish a surprisingly big portion of the video, but in the end, I never finished the video. So what happened? I don't quite remember, but I assume I lost the motivation for it at some point. There could also be a possibility that I was overwhelmed with a different video project, aka the best of 2018 video, although I doubt this as I started working on the video way before the end of 2018. Although what raises a bigger eyebrow is the fact that I last worked on this video at the end of January of 2019, as shown by my edit history of the script. Will this video ever get a remake though? Well, it already has gotten a remake. Kinda. I'd consider the event of the year throughout the years video to be a remake of this video, because I cover a lot of events throughout every year of Roblox, and for that reason I will not be remaking this video. Plus, there's no point. Why would I make a video about 2018 events in 2022? Doesn't make much sense in my opinion. Now you probably haven't heard of this video, but this video was another video that got a decent amount of progress. This video was meant to come out somewhere in July of 2019, but I never finished it. A good portion of the script was written for it, and around a minute or so of the video was edited, but sadly I lost the footage. I still have the script, but the video was edited on my old phone, which was later given to my sister, and then after that my phone was stored away. I'm sure even if I got my old phone to work, I couldn't find the files for this video, so this is super sad chat. But why did I never finish this video? Well, unlike the DDLC review, I was actually dissatisfied with the editing process of this video, rather than the script writing. I just didn't have much fun making it, and so I decided to never finish it. I don't remember much from this video, but I asked Fizz to make this render for me for that video, which I ended up using numerous times, most notably in the Roblox is kinda boring video. Will I f ever finish this project? That will be a no, because this video is outdated and the topic itself is rather boring. It's already been covered by Epic Rika, so if you care about spam bots on Roblox that much, you can go watch her video. Ah yes, my Econ 2019 review. This was originally going to be my first ever review on my channel, but I never made it. I still don't quite remember why, but oh well. The video was meant to come out at some point in late April or early May of 2019, but that never happened. I wrote around a thousand words of the script, and I did actually edit some of the portions of the video, and they have been publicly available on my second channel for years now. But yeah, this video wasn't some random one-off video, these sections were going to be in the original Egg Hunt 2019 review. I made them to mock the bad arguments used against Egg Hunt 2019, although some of the arguments I critiqued do make sense to me nowadays. But why? Why did I never finish this review? I'm assuming it was just demotivation and a lack of purpose since my friend at the time, Sherry BRB, had made an Econ 2019 review. 
So is it ever going to be remade? Yes, actually, and I am planning to remake it this year because I want to review Econ 2018 and 2019, although I still haven't started my Econ 2019 project. Although this Econ 2019 review will be completely different from the Econ 2019 review I wrote all those years ago. I don't remember much about this video, but I decided to talk about it because I completely forgot about it and it's a bit of an interesting case for me. This video was meant to come out sometime around Econ 2019, and it was going to be my longest video. Sadly, this video only exists in screenshots now, since the video never came out, and also it was edited on my old phone. According to the screenshots that remain, I managed to edit over an hour of this video, which is pretty impressive. This video was actually well made and I liked it, although I lost it due to some strange circumstances. So why did it never come out? Well, one of the reasons was because I lost it, although I don't remember why I never finished the video. It was close to completion since I had edited it over an hour, but I'm pretty sure I was done with like 50%. It's pretty obvious that I'll never remake this video since Econ 2019 ended a while ago and there is no point in posting a tutorial for an expired event. As the title suggests, this was a collab between me and Sir Samuel. It was meant to come out in early 2021, somewhere around late January or early February. I was going to edit his footage and he was going to edit mine. It was a cool idea at the time and we did make a good progress. Sam edited my footage and sent it to me, although I never started. So what happened? Well, the footage I gave was extremely boring, contained offensive jokes, and it was recorded when I was really bad at solo commentaries without a script. The edited video also has its flaws, like having minimal editing and my voice just being barely audible. And the footage Sam sent me wasn't much better either. It didn't make sense since he was playing Super Checkpoint, a game where you'd rather focus on the game rather than talk about something. I also wanted to make the editing for his section way too good, so perfectionism strikes again and ruins another video. But will this video ever come out? I could try again with this idea at some point, although if we're talking about the old version, it will never be an actual video. Even the modern version might never come out since nowadays Sir Samuel is the laziest man ever and never uploads, so he'd probably never finish editing my video. So there's that too. Believe it or not, there are actually a lot of cancelled with friends and viewers videos. Most of them got cancelled for a similar reason, although let's go over which ones I canned. Quiplash with friends and viewers, Word Bomb with friends and viewers, Crap Game with friends and viewers, GeoGuessr with friends and viewers, and Tetrio with friends and viewers. Yeah, there are a lot, and these are just the ones I recorded. All of these were recorded at some point in time, but none of these were ever edited, apart from a bit of the Quiplash video, I believe. But what happened? The main reason why I never finished these with friends and viewers episodes is due to the controversies they generated. I felt guilty turning these into fully edited videos, and also they brought back bad memories. S some of them were just boring, for example the word bomb videos, so I never made them into videos because they were too boring. I might edit some of these videos and upload them onto my channel, but I don't know if I'll ever decide to do that. I have actually cancelled future with friends and viewers videos, so these old recordings are probably the last hope of the series. You never know, maybe you'll see one of the mentioned videos uploaded to the channel, but I can't say for certain. The video with the most progress in terms of these cancelled videos is most likely my Doki Doki Literature Club review. This video was meant to release on September 22nd last year, or in the year 2021. This video is also meant to be my best video on my channel, and if you think that one of these three videos was good, this video was meant to be twice as good. I think you can see why I gave up on this project. I managed to finish editing around 8 minutes of this video, and the script has 2,300 words, so I did manage to finish something. In case you couldn't tell, this video was meant to be a review on DDLC. Wow. But also I was going to review DDLC plus and take a look at some fan made mods of DDLC. I was also going to analyze the deeper meanings of the story and analyze the poems, which are both things I'm not very good at. So why did I never finish this video? Well, the main reason is that this sort of thing has already been done before. There are many other reviews of Doki Doki that are just way better than mine ever could be since they know what they're talking about. Of course, you could argue that my video would be different and still interesting because it's made by me, but there's no point in telling me this now since I have stopped working on it. 
There were also some other reasons, like my deep motivation while writing the script, perfectionism making me try way too hard to make even just a simple sentence sound elegant, and also my inability to retell the main story of DDLC. A lot of different factors led me to canning the project, and instead making the Roblox Tycoons video that month, which turned out to be the better decision. I might still finish the DDLC review at some point in time though. I could make it like my PVZ review, which to me was actually fun to make. But only time will tell if I will get the motivation to ever do anything with this video. The Halloween Night sequel was meant to be the sequel for my Roblox mission of the Halloween Night. Big shocker, I know. It was meant to release on October 31st, 2021, but it never saw the light of day. The script didn't even get past the first section, and even that first section is very rough and has minimal dialogue. My ideas for the sequel were all over the place, so most of the document is just ideas for what the video could have been. But what happened? My demotivation with a project, that's what happened. This video was extremely unfun to work on, and I just couldn't be bothered to write the script. I was going to ask Slashy to write the majority of it, like we did last year, but because I couldn't explain what I really wanted, she never could write anything out of my jumble of ideas. I also suffered from a lack of consistency in the project. This video was also replaced by the Plants vs Zombies review, which I had a lot more motivation for, so there's that too. But will the sequel ever see the light of day? Maybe. I'm not sure, I might make it into a video next year, but I'm not sure anymore. I guess we'll have to wait until next Halloween to see. Fun fact, the Halloween Night itself was a cancelled project, but I remade it in 2020. The original Halloween Night was really bad and was only 3 minutes long, but the new one is... Still bad, but it's 8 minutes long now. Oh god, this video. This video was meant to come out on December 24th of 2021, and it was going to be reviewing my friends and associates' avatars. This video was my Curse of Quipmas this year, which if you don't know what Quipmas is, I talk more about it in my Iceberg video, but to give a basic idea, it's a holiday in my Discord server where Quip gives gifts to people. My gift in 2021 was to review people's avatars with memes while also collaborating with Osira. The script was almost finished, Osira did all of his sections, and I did like half of my sections. I started editing the video and I managed to edit a minute of it, which is only the intro portion of the video. The video, if finished, would have been around 10 to 13 minutes, so why was it never finished? Wouldn't this video be easier to make since it's shorter? Well, the reason this video was scrapped was due to my dissatisfaction with the project. There were many issues that were demotivating me when making this video. Firstly, Osiris malaise with the concept of it. Although this issue was solved, it was still slammed and I took it too seriously. Second, I didn't have the motivation to finish the script. I just didn't feel like writing the sections as I had very minimal experiences with rating avatars, especially with a measuring unit that I am very unfamiliar with. Third, editing this video was a chore. I just didn't have any ideas for how to edit this video, and this is a common trend among my intros in these videos. It's usually the start and the end are the hardest to make because that's when I have the least motivation to edit a video. And lastly, I had the event of the year throughout the years video to finish. This video was intimidating since it was very long and was a collaboration with Zom, so I took it way more seriously than this video. Will this Quipma special ever come out though? It's hard to say, but I'm leaning towards a no here. There isn't a point to this video anymore as Quipmas is over and I personally don't feel like working on it anyway. Looks like I'll be cursed this year by Quip, but all I can do is cry about it, I guess. And that's everything I want to talk about today. It's sad when a video project doesn't see the light of day, but sometimes a sacrifice has to be made for something bigger and better to overtake its spot. But anyway, remember everyone, stay in school, don't do drugs, and don't beat yourself up for a cancelled project. Always look on the bright side. I'll see you in the next one.